The Viperidae are a family of venomous snakes found all over the world, except in Antarctica, Australia, New Zealand, Ireland, Madagascar, Hawaii, various other isolated islands, and north of the Arctic Circle. All have relatively long, hinged fangs that permit deep penetration and injection of venom. Four subfamilies are currently recognized. They are also known as viperids. Description All viperids have a pair of relatively long solenoglyphous fangs that are used to inject venom from glands located towards the rear of the upper jaws. Each of the two fangs is at the front of the mouth on a short maxillary bone that can rotate back and forth. When not in use, the fangs fold back against the roof of the mouth and are enclosed in a membranous sheath. The left and right fangs can be rotated together or independently. During a strike, the mouth can open nearly 180 a degree and the maxilla rotates forward, erecting the fangs as late as possible so as the fangs do not become damaged. The jaws close on impact and powerful muscles that surround the venom glands contract to inject the venom as the fangs penetrate. This action is very fast. In defensive strikes, it will be more a stab than a bite. Viperids use this mechanism primarily for immobilization and digestion of prey. Secondarily, it is used for self-defense, though in cases with non-prey, such as humans, they may give a dry bite. Almost all vipers have keeled scales, a stocky build with a short tail, and, due to the location of the venom glands, a triangle-shaped head distinct from the neck. The great majority have vertically elliptical, or slit-shaped, pupils that can open wide to cover most of the eye or close almost completely, which helps them to see in a wide range of light levels. Typically, vipers are nocturnal and ambush their prey. Compared to many other snakes, vipers often appear rather sluggish. Most are oviviparous, giving birth to live young, but a few lay eggs. The word viper is derived from Latin vivo equals I live, and pario equals I give birth. Geographic range Viperid snakes are found in the Americas, Africa and Eurasia. In the Americas, they are native from southern Canada, through the United States, Mexico, Central America and into South America. The adder branch of the Viperidae family contains the only venomous snake found in the United Kingdom. Wild viperids are not found in Australia. Behavior Experiments have shown these snakes are capable of making decisions on how much venom to inject depending on the circumstances. In all cases, the most important determinant of venom expenditure is generally the size of the snake, with larger specimens being capable of delivering much more venom. The species is also important, since some are likely to inject more venom than others, may have more venom available, strike more accurately, or deliver a number of bites in a short time. In predatory bites, factors that influence the amount of venom injected include the size of the prey, the species of prey, and whether the prey item is held or released. The need to label prey for chemosensory relocation after a bite and release may also play a role. In defensive bites, the amount of venom injected may be determined by the size or species of the predator, as well as the assessed level of threat. Although larger assailants and higher threat levels may not necessarily lead to larger amounts of venom being injected. Venom Viperid venoms typically contain an abundance of protein degrading enzymes, called proteases, that produce symptoms such as pain, strong local swelling and necrosis, blood loss from cardiovascular damage complicated by coagulopathy, and disruption of the blood clotting system. Death is usually caused by collapse in blood pressure. This is in contrast to elapid venoms that generally contain neurotoxins that disable muscle contraction and cause paralysis. Death from elapid bites usually results from asphyxiation because the diaphragm can no longer contract. However, this rule does not always apply. Some elapid bites include proteolytic symptoms typical of viperid bites, while some viperid bites produce neurotoxic symptoms. Proteolytic venom is also dual purpose. Firstly, it is used for defense and to immobilize prey, as with neurotoxic venoms. Secondly, many of the venom's enzymes have a digestive function, breaking down molecules in prey items, such as lipids, nucleic acids, and proteins. This is an important adaptation, as many vipers have inefficient digestive systems. 
due to the nature of proteolytic venom. A biprid bite is often a very painful experience and should always be taken seriously, though it may not necessarily prove fatal. Even with prompt and proper treatment, a bite can still result in a permanent scar, and in the worst cases, the affected limb may even have to be amputated. A victim's fate is impossible to predict, as this depends on many factors, including the species and size of the snake involved, how much venom was injected, and the size and condition of the patient before being bitten. Viper bite victims may also be allergic to the venom and or the antivenom. Subfamilies Type genus equals Viper Euro Laurenti, 1768. Taxonomy, that Viperidae family is attributed to Opal, as opposed to Laurenti or Gray, is subject to some interpretation. However, the consensus among leading experts is that Laurenti used Viperae as the plural of Vipera and did not intend for it to indicate a family group taxon. Rather, it is attributed to Opal, based on his Viperinae as a distinct family group name despite the fact that Gray was the first to use the form Viperinae. See also, Viperidae by common name, Viperidae by taxonomic synonyms, list of snakes, overview of all snake families and genera, snake bite, references. Further reading. External links, Viperidae at the Reptarium CZ Reptile Database. Access November 3, 2008. A Viper. The American Cyclopedia. 1879A, a viper. The New Student's Reference Work 1914A.